this shit. Me, brick by brick, and I'll be damned for letting you tear it down just cause you don't like the way another nigga talk. Welcome to Asians of Screen, and we're back again for yet another season finale reaction. This time for season four of Snowfall. Off the bat, I am your boy Miles, AKA the Bull Beyonce. And let me know immediately what has been your favorite moment this season. Mine? It was when Franklin was talking to the crew and he was like, but if not, then keep your heads down, keep your mouth shut, and let me take care of this. I gotta take care of every motherfucking thing else. <laughs> <laughs> oh my god, if there's one thing Franklin Saint will do, he will give you a fucking speech. He'll give you a speech like in season three. I'll build this shit. Me, brick by brick. And I'll be damned for letting you tear it down just because you don't like the way another nigga talk. <laughs> oh my god, my ribs are hurting. My ribs are hurting. Oh. I'm having too much fun. But I must look absolutely ridiculous doing this in a hot pink robe with a pink do-rag. But who cares? Large up dancing Idris every single time. What a phenomenal actor. I hope he gets more movie roles. But please, please, please let me know what's been your favorite moments this season in the comments below. But this season has been, you know, so far in Snowfall season one, season two, season three, it's been a upward crescendo in terms of their success, in terms of their progress in the, in the crack game. But this season is starting to go downhill. The cost has been heavy, lives have been lost, people have been shot. The crew is seeming to, their patience is wearing thin. The CIA is getting outed. It's a lot going on and it's pretty much on a knife's edge right now. In the last episode, an obstacle, two big obstacles, Manboy and Khadija seemingly are solved, but who knows what the fallout is gonna be as a result of this. So this is why we're here for the reaction. I did plan to review this episode by episode, but this is not even out in the UK. It's weird because of the whole Fox thing. It's releasing later, we haven't got it yet, so I had to do an absolute madness to watch this. So the least I can do is do a season finale because I've been thoroughly enjoying the season so far. But that being said, <laughs> I've had enough fun. Let's get into the season finale. And what do you guys think about how Franklin handled the situation with Leon? What would you have done? Would you have given Leon up to let him get killed? Or would you have tried to play the, the game like we Franklin? We also, Franklin needs some physical therapy, bro. He's been moving like Willy Wonka this whole season. I don't respect their rules. And I'm about to drop one on you. He goes by the alias Reed Thompson. Oh, Jesus. I know his real name. And I got pictures. And I'm about to put that out in the public so the world can see. Then we gonna see what the CIA oh, has to say God. about the boy. Y'all heard it here first. Be right back. Mother of God. Somebody's got to go, bro. Somebody's got to go. This ain't a joke. Hey, might get the fuck out right now. Yeah, Frank and you heard the man. Get your shit and get the fuck out. Franklin said into a devil, I can't lie. It broke my heart when he uh, finessed those black book owners, the store owners. That broke my heart when he did that. I know you have to be a devil in this field, but... Mother of God, Franklin, what has happened to you? Is that the same leather jacket you was wearing like 20 years ago? Thought you came along. Dead. Is that Scully in them? That's Scully, Got boy. Fuck. Is Scully dead? Scully went out like a bitch, I can't lie. I'll go. After all of that, that's how you wanted that's how I know he was desperate and angry, but Nah. Was she he's alive? How? How? How did it allow him to leave the premises alive? But fair enough, he didn't go out like a bitch, like I said. But no way, bro. They had to drop on him. I wouldn't be surprised if also is in the distance with a sniper rifle or some somewhere. Cause Reed is very smart. He's he's played this game his whole life. I'm telling you, these are just ideas. I'm a person. I'm not, I'm not the system that you hate. <laughs> not only are you that system, fact that you don't even know 
It illustrates how deeply ingrained white supremacy is in the United States of America. Facts. A country created by men like you, for men like you, and nobody else. Facts. If you doubt that, go take a ride through South Central tonight. See how my people live. Ah. Uh, what did you do? Classic manipulation. Classic manipulation. He brought him here to have leverage. He could take something away from him that he loves. Oh! Ah! Where's your man at? He went home for the night. Don't lie. No, to not me. Louis. Not Louis. Alfred. Not like this. Put the gun down. Not like this. Not like this. Angel on one shoulder, devil on yeah. one shoulder. Franklin! Hey. Let the drop on him! Yeah. Why did it say, hey, just come get behind him? You want right here. Right. He hasn't to choose between two devils. He's gonna choose Reed or his father. But then their relationship is fractured. Even if he leaves Reed and Franklin, their relationship will never be the same again. If I was Scully, I know I'm dead anyway. I'm killing everyone. I ain't, I know one ain't talking me down. As I said, he's a madman. His, his baby, his wife, gone. Crew, mashup. Cousin, brother-in-law, everyone gone. I'm taking everyone with me. No one can talk me down. They want out, I'm sure. Right now, Franklin is an island. He is desperate for them to stay. Mama's gone, dad's gone. Leon's on the fence. He can't run this shit by himself. Leon wants out, fam. I ain't trying to dump more shit on your lap or nothing, but I'm not sure if I'm with any of it anymore. As expected. After that little girl died, his heart his heart broke. His spirit yeah. broke. You look nice. You yeah, look nice. It's your brother. That the Cuban dress, yeah? The other day. She looking like a Boricua mom. Coffee's on. That thing is moving! Look at his face, he knows it's moving too. I'm supposed to read that book. My 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 brethren Jordan shout shout out Jordan if you're watching this. But he he uh he recommended this book to me still the spookies. Where'd you forget? Oh Sister. god. You looking like Tony Montana. It was too good to be true. No one rides off into the sunset. I wonder if Sissy knows. You reckon Sissy really knows? This was the beginning of something. Very ironic, the book I that he's that reading. Before you meet your end. Melody. Does See, one thing with Melody, yeah? It hurts me to say it. But her wigs, even from the beginning, have always been... Hey, Mel. I ain't gonna finish that. Her wigs, boy. Her wigs. I said, in a car accident. Shit, could happen to anyone. Boy is a devil. It's one thing. You tell me the truth, you'll never hear from me again. Did you kill my father? Admit that you killed my daddy. Give her closure. Being man enough to tell me that I'm not crazy. Kiss me that at least. Is there any way she can record him? If not, give her the closure that she needs. Goodbye, Mel. Take care of yourself. Final words. Oh shit, Willy Wonka! He can walk! Is he gonna do the cartwheel? Hey, some Kaiser Soze usual, usual suspect shit. Hey, let's get Franklin's back. Franklin's back. He can walk. It's a miracle. 
I'm not the, the symbolism has not missed on me. Crucifix on the wall in the church. He has risen again. He can walk. My light has gone out on my camera, but it's so good. Who knows what that Curtis Mayfield though? I'm your pusher, hey, we know what is You have to excuse me, my light died. My battery, I can't even charge it. I don't know where the charger is, but I'm having to do some makeshift business to get some light in, but I'ma just finish this video. But it was a good episode. What I will say though, is that in terms of the stakes, intensity, the climax, the episode before this had more. So it felt a little bit underwhelming. So even though it was still a good episode, it had less of that. It served more as a setup for season five, which we know is gonna be greenlit. I don't know for sure if season five is supposed to be the final season, but this episode leaves us on a nice edge and sets up season five. We don't know what's gonna happen with Leon, Louis, Jerome, what's happening with Reed, is Alton dead? Is Sissy in on it? He has no more competition left. Scully's dead, Man Boy is left. What's gonna happen? Lucia is possibly back in the picture. So there's a lot of questions and there's a lot of story threads that still need to be tied up and put a bow on. So it, it was still a good final episode. And that exit with the walk, I love that. I thought he was gonna admit to her that he did indeed kill her father, but you know, he's smarter than that. And he has no love left for Melody that, that died in season season two was it speaking of like the earlier season it's been so interesting watching franklin's progression from season one till now like the the change in his character being so scared and surprised of the brutality of the street life and now he's fully adopted it he's molded in it just like bane but i literally have no idea of what's gonna happen in season five i have no clue what is franklin gonna do because he seems even though he's come out of this obstacle of this situation high pressure everything was on the line he's seemingly an island at this point and he doesn't really have anyone close to him male or female so it'll be interesting to see how it all develops but let me know what you guys thought of the season four as a whole and this season finale episode how you think it's going to progress in season five if you think he made the right decisions leading up to this very moment, but you could see everything being foreshadowed. You can see everyone's patience wearing thin. Even Franklin himself, I'm sure he's tired of the shit, but it seems like he's made a decision in his head that he's gonna take this as far as he can take it. He put the cane down. He's back to what he was. That's the kind of symbolism of that scene. But I'ma keep it there. I've been your boy, Miles. We have been the agents of screen. And until the next video, which should be coming extremely soon, Falcon and the Winter Soldier season finale coming tomorrow. See you there. The road will be back. See you soon. Peace. <laughs> and I'll be damned if I let you tear it down just because you don't like the way another nigga talk. <laughs> I built this shit. Me. Brick by brick. And I'll be damned if I let you tear it down just because you don't like the way another nigga talk.